residents in Russell County and leaders in neighboring Scott County expressing concern about a redevelopment proposal. It's our top story. The County Board of Supervisors considering a plan to convert a former mine site into a private landfill. You can see here the landfill would be just off of Gravel Lick Row. News Channel 11's Katherine Simpson took the trip to Russell County and found out why residents are opposed to the project. This is the former Moss 3 coal preparation plant. Local economic development leaders say a plan to transform part of the property into a landfill would be a big economic boost, but local residents have organized against the project. This is going to just tear everything, it's going to tear everything down. David Wallace farms thousands of acres just a few miles from the proposed landfill site. He believes a landfill would jeopardize the county's opportunity to invest in sustainable farming and tourism. That's what we need to be focusing on. Wallace isn't alone. I passed dozens of signs urging Russell County County leaders not to allow the landfill. We're worth so much more than trash. Amy Branson started advocating against the landfill as soon as she learned about the potential plan for it. Branson says not only is the property unsuitable for a landfill, the proposed use would also pose a threat to the nearby Clinch River and downstream communities in Scott County. So if you're relying on that river, this matters to you. Friday morning, the Scott County Board of Supervisors voted to send a letter to Russell County expressing concerns about the project. But Russell County Supervisor and Board Chairman Steve Breeding told us strict regulations for new landfills would prevent any negative impacts and that building a landfill could help the county continue collecting residents' trash free of charge. He said, quote, as these costs continue to rise, I would imagine we're eventually going to have a user fee or to raise taxes to cover the cost. But Wallace says the money isn't worth it. In my eyes, you're putting money over people at that point. Uh, the natural beauty in this natural land is all really I think we have. In Russell County, Katherine Simpson, News Channel 11. Thank you, Katherine. The Russell County Board of Supervisors set to hold a public hearing on the host agreement for the project next week. The chair of that board told us a draft agreement could be ready in the next few weeks. We also reached out to the company behind the project. We have not yet heard back.